if you're in need of a haircut and don't mind taking it all off, we have quite an event to tell you about here with details. There's Shannon Montemuro and Dr. Jason Eustine, a pediatric oncologist from Texas Children's Hospital. Thank you both so much for being here. And we're going to be talking about a big event that's coming up this weekend. Tell us what it is and how many people are going to be shaving off all that hair. Great. On Sunday afternoon at the Goose's Acre in the Woodlands at 4 o'clock, um, we're going to be shaving heads to raise money for pediatric cancer research. We currently have 45 people signed up. We've raised over $26,000 so far. That is a and big commitment for somebody. If for mm -hmm. that many people to say, I'm going to shave my head. Yep. So Absolutely. that shows how important it is for people. Pediatric cancer, how prevalent are we talking about? So it's not as prevalent uh, as adult cancers, fortunately, mm -hmm. but we still have a significant number. It's over 150,000 children worldwide are diagnosed with cancer each year. That is a lot of mm -hmm. children. And, and how does this money help? Helps a long way. It goes towards uh, helping with research and clinical, both clinical and basic science research. Are you hoping that more people will sign up to shave their heads? Absolutely, absolutely. I would think that once you do that, it's easy to carry the message because people, especially a woman, it would be even more obvious, are going to ask you what in the world. Right, yeah, this year we already have nine women signed up to shave their heads. Um, I have shaved my head three times in the past and it definitely gets a reaction. People <laughs> look at you a little differently and want to know why. Tell us why you're so passionate and why you have been involved with it so many times. Um, in uh, 2007, my then two and a half year old son was diagnosed with um, rhabdomyosarcoma. And my husband and I found, about, found out about the organization in 2008 and quickly realized that we wanted to get involved um, and give back to the community and help raise much needed um, money for research. How proud does it make you of our community to see people coming out and, and supporting? I mean, this is a, a fundraiser where, it, as I said, I mean, it really takes a lot of passion toward this to shave your head. Oh, it's a wonderful thing. I mean, it's great that people come out in these numbers, not just here in Houston, but also across the nation and even across the world now. So yeah. how can people get involved? They can uh, go online to stbaldricks.org. Uh, they could find our event um, by putting in like a zip code or something. Uh, they could donate money. They can show up and support and at, at the event and raise money. And if they decide to, they could show up and shave their head. We'll do it at the last minute and hopefully they can raise <laughs> some money for us. Dr. Eustine and Shannon, thank you so much for being here and spreading this important message. And we can't wait to see you afterwards yeah. with the new look. Right. <laughs> thank you. Natalie. Thank you. Well, spring break